Hello, a warm welcome, and this is the scene here in North London. My name is Derek Ray, excited to be bringing you match commentary, and alongside me, my broadcasting partner, Stuart Robson. And looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It is Tottenham Hotspur taking on Chelsea. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I've played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. And the starting 11 for Spurs. And this is how it looks for Chelsea. Well, they're going to play with a slightly withdrawn centre forward who will look to find space behind the opposition's midfield but it's important he doesn't drop too deep, otherwise his partner will get isolated. And now they get the ball rolling. Pavier. Good tackle. It'll be a throw. Emerson. And Pavier with it. Given away by Tottenham. Free kick to Chelsea. Chilwell. Here's Kovacic. Havertz. Timely intervention. Well, I think many would agree Hyung Min Son seems to be at the peak of his powers now. In what way might he contribute today, Stuart? Well, he's such a natural finisher. He has everything a good goal scorer needs. Composure, technique and awareness. He will certainly need to be tightly marked today. And denied by the crossbar. But it wasn't going to count. It's offside. Kane. Effective challenge. Well, he's got past his man. Ah, well, fair enough. That's a good recovery. Pavier. Well, that's a well-timed pass. And he's through. An early goal. It is the ideal opening. Well, here's the replay. What a pass this is from Havertz. And a really powerful strike from João Felix. Great technique. That's a top-class goal. Away they go again. Now can Spurs come up with an answer? Ivan Perisic. Now Chelsea in a position of menace. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. Thank you. 
Well, Chelsea unable to retain possession. Son. Skip. Looking for that final pass and for that chance to level the game. Really vital interception here. Joao Felix. Well, spot on with that challenge. Mateo Kovacic. Enzo Fernandez. This looks threatening. Don't be comfortable in bringing that ball down. Good pressure. Can they make something of this? Firing it towards goal. Well, that's fine goalkeeping. Real concentration. An example of a goalkeeper in top form here. Well, now he's let that run out of play and it will be a throw-in here. Oliver Skip. Kane. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. Well, tremendous block. Well, as those stats show us, Chelsea haven't controlled the possession of the game. But when they have had it, they've looked so dangerous, particularly when they press high up the field, win the ball back in those areas, and then counter-attack quickly. Badi Achille. And Chelsea get the decision from the referee. Havertz. Possession lost. Almost at half time, not quite, but a story of Spurs behind in this game. And Stewart, as ever, keen to get your assessment. Well, it's been a tight first half so far, but they haven't quite shown enough guile in the attacking third. If, however, they can be more dynamic in the 1v1 situations, they have the quality to turn this around. Enzo Fernandez. Well, adding up all the stoppages, we will have two extra minutes. Joao Felix. Felix. Making sure it didn't get past him. And with that, the first half draws to a close. Well, Joao Felix played his part in the first half. Sum up his contribution for us. Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them the lead, but his general play was really good. He was a constant threat, and I'm sure we'll see more of him in the second half. So underway again, Chelsea with the lead, but absolutely no room for complacency. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Trying to really get at the opposition here. Efficient play to hold on to the ball and wait for teammates to get there. Could be a chance to break here. Well, that is how to break up a counter-attack. Song. Free kick to Chelsea.
Disappointing pass. Emerson. Havertz. Joao Felix. Can he finish this? And with that, they've thwarted the opportunity. Not a short corner here, and a useful cross. Another perfect position to read it. Thirty minutes left for play. Harry Kane. Enzo Fernandez. A poor cross, all things considered. Couldn't grab hold of it. Just cleared away in the nick of time. Harry Kane. And on to Kurusevsky. They're getting right on top of their opponents and winning it back. A Spurs free kick it's going to be. Substitution time it is here. And the keeper more than equal to the task. Well, just listen to the crowd. They know this is a big chance to equalise. So a personnel change then. A short corner. He might be able to carve something out. Well, that's fine goalkeeping. Real concentration. Well, opting for the short corner. No foul. Spurs advantage. He takes aim. And it nestles in the back of the net. A goal for Tottenham Hotspur, who now are on level terms. Well, let's take another look. And wow, how cleanly does he hit that? The keeper was never going to save it. What a good goal that is. So underway again, following the goal that made things level. Rhys James. Kukureya. And Havertz. Good looking cross. Making high pressing work for them here. And Chelsea get the decision from the referee.
Now to the front post. Well, I suspected that might be difficult for the keeper, but I was wrong. He's got space. Spurs still on the attack with the minutes ticking away. Can they find a winner? Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. That'll be a Spurs ball. Spurs have decided to make a double substitution. Into the advanced position. Lucas Moura. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Well, these fans are driving their team on here, but can Tottenham find a winning goal? Not long left now. And here now come Tottenham. A goal at this late stage could settle the issue. And that's a straightforward stop. Mateo Kovacic. Kukureya. Joao Felix. Read it superbly to take back possession. Spurs get the advantage from the referee. Perisic. Superbly read and executed. Ziyech. This looks threatening. And he's in. And the keeper more than equal to it. They decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Playing it in. And with that, the 90 minutes have come to an end. An even contest.